Hi everyone, Teresa here and welcome to my everyday. So today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys and if you're interested in seeing what I picked up at Dollar Tree this time, just stay tuned. So Easter is quickly approaching and I wanted to pick up a few things for my kids and my niece and nephew and so I picked up these little baskets. They're the inside is like a cardboard and then they're covered in the, like this canvas and they have a little handle. So I just wanted a little something to put something in. I just thought they were really, really cute. I don't always do baskets. I don't think you have to give your kids a lot of things at Easter. That's just me. So I picked up this cute little one either for my daughter or for my niece with the little chick on it. I also picked up another pink one in um, with the bunny rabbit on it. So again, this one is either for my niece or for my daughter. And then I picked up two more that have bunnies on them. I picked up a green one and a blue one, probably giving the green one to my nephew because green is his favorite color. And then my son will probably get the blue one. I just thought they were really super cute. They're not huge, so I can put two or three things inside and then they can have a little treat for Easter. Other people give them things, so like I said, I don't think they need a whole lot but just a little something to say we're celebrating Easter and here's a little treat for you now to go inside of those little baskets I did find these little hopping toys I just love these they're the ones that you wind up and they bounce around I used to love these as a kid so I picked up two of the little chicks and then I also got two of the little bunnies. I just know that my kids are gonna love these. And so I picked up four, um, two of each, so that my kids and both my niece and nephew can have them. My daughter has already seen them at the Dollar Tree and was super excited. I kind of had to divert her from seeing them because I didn't want her to ask or try and buy them herself. They're just really super cute and I'm super excited to give this to them. The next item is something I've seen people hauling over and over again and I just couldn't leave it behind. I got this cute little flower pot in the metallic like tin and it says flowers and garden. I don't know if I'm going to use it indoors to decorate or outside once the weather gets nicer, but I just thought it was really nice really really nice and I was worried that they wouldn't have it anymore once I finally decided that I was going to do something with it. I got another package of nails. I got these in the stiletto or almond shape. I actually started using these again recently and tried the stiletto style again and really enjoyed them. They actually lasted a very long time. I think these ones actually fit my nail shape a little bit better so I thought I'd give them a try again and I really love this black and white pattern so I got another set. Found something a little bit different this time at my Dollar Tree. I found these baked breadsticks in the Mediterranean style and I just thought they looked really good so I thought I would give them a try. Also found these Pringles Tostitos or tortillas um, and I have tried these before and my son really enjoyed them. They are in the Fiesta Salsa flavor so I thought I would try them again. I was really excited to see that my Dollar Tree had these Global Beauty Care wipes again. These are in the Aloe Vera Extract. These are my favorite. I like to carry them around in my purse and then wipe up any messes or clean my hands or something like that whenever I need it or if my kids need to clean their face. I just find they're nice and gentle and so I like to carry them around. They did bring out a whole bunch of different brands. I just didn't like them very much, so I'm really glad that they brought these ones back. And another new item at my Dollar Tree, they have this Kraken Eggs Microwave Egg Cooker. We actually make eggs in the microwave all the time. It's great for young kids. My daughter who likes to make her way through the kitchen but not always confident using the stove in the oven, likes to cook her eggs in the microwave all the time and we usually use a bowl, but I thought this was really neat. She was really excited to see it. We were gonna buy two of them but we thought we would try one this time. This one I think is neat because I think it kind of holds the shape of an egg, I think. I don't know, I might have to let you guys know what it's like, but I've seen a few people haul them and I've seen some commercials of things that are similar to them, so I wanted to try it out and see what it's like. Also picked up these um, little ballet style socks. They're the ones that you can put on and if you're wearing ballet flats you don't quite see your socks. So they had these cute, this cute little pattern and the blue. They are in the children's size. They're 10 to 13 but I thought I might actually be able to wear them as well because 
I have really small feet, so I thought I would try them, and if I don't like them, then I'll just give them to my daughter. And then, of course, I'm always decluttering and organizing, and I am obsessed with bins and anything organization, so I picked up two more of these. I thought I could use them in my office, perhaps in a drawer or something to hold paper clips, push pins, that kind of thing. I love these little dividers. They actually have a lid on them, so I don't have to worry about opening a drawer and everything spilling all over the place, so I got two more of those. Now, Dollar Tree always has these really cool grow towels, they're the ones that you put in water and then you get a face cloth. I thought it was really neat this time. They had them in the WWE, so for wrestling. And so I actually picked this up for my brother. He's a great wrestling fan. I thought I would either give it to him or put it in his stocking at Christmas. I just thought it was really neat and I could not pass up getting it. Now I love Soft Lips Lip Balm and they had some at the Dollar Tree, so I could not pass that up either. At the drugstore, they're about three, four, five dollars. This is in the hydrating lip balm in the French vanilla. Usually I like the cherry or the raspberry but I thought I would try the vanilla this time and like I said they're way more expensive at the drugstore so I thought I would pick this up at the Dollar Tree for $1.25 you just can't beat it. Now a few hauls ago I picked up a candle in the Rose Collection of New York and it was black. I went back and I picked up this really pretty blue one. I just really like the scent of this one. I did not burn the black one. I really like the way it looks for decoration so I probably won't burn it but this one just smells so so good. I don't even know how to describe it. It's almost like a spa smell. I really also really like this blue color. I don't know if it's coming off on camera very well, but I just really liked it, and so I'm gonna try and burn it. I will say I have had a few people message me to let me know that if you burn these ones all the way down, the glass will crack, so be very careful if you do get them yourself. I don't tend to burn my candles all the way down. I also don't tend to burn my candles for very long, so um, I definitely will keep an eye on this one, but just to let you guys know, that's what I've heard about these candles. Picked up a Sharpie because you can never have too many Sharpies, and lately my daughter has been stealing them from me, so I got one more. And my Dollar Tree has been getting a whole bunch of new makeup items. I have a lot of makeup, so I did not need to pick any up, but they had some new highlighters and some bronzers, some new blushes, they had a whole bunch of new eyeshadows, some new of those liquid lipsticks, they had them in the nudes, they had them in the glossy, they had them in the matte, but I did want to pick up these little eyeshadows. They had this Mariposa Metallic Eyeshadow and they're just these little singles. I just thought they were so nice. So I picked this one up in the color... It doesn't have a color. Anyway, this one is like a nice metallic like mauve color. And then I also picked it up in this, it's almost like a taupe. And then the third one that I picked up is more like a goldy brown and I just thought that I would try these out. I will swatch them for you guys because I'm also really curious to see what they are like. So I will start off with this brownie goldy color. Feels really nice and creamy actually. And that is it. I don't know if you can see it swatched on my hand. Just right there. That is like a nice highlight actually. I'm going to try the taupey color next. It's number five. The brownie gold one was number six. So just try this taupey one. They're quite powdery, but again, they're quite creamy at the same time. Like they blend really nicely. This taupey one is actually coming off more of like a silver. And again, that's a great highlight color. So I'm really interested to see what the purple one is like. That is in the number seven. and it is really pretty. So there's all three of them swatched on the back of my hand. I'm super excited to give these a try. I was super excited to find them. Now on the way out um, towards the cache, they always have tons of stuff on that end cap, and I actually found these little zippered pouches. Um, they're just basically like a plastic, um, so really cheaply made, but um, lately I've been carrying around a lot of things in my purse that I want to keep separate and not just laying in the bottom of my bag. And 
And so I thought this would be really nice actually to put either coupons or loose makeup or even a snack. I find that I don't always want to throw in a Ziploc bag in my purse, but it's nice to have just some snacks in like a little pouch. And I thought this one was just really pretty with the owls on it. So that's why I picked up that one. And then the very last thing that I picked up, again, Easter, right around the corner were these cute little bunny ears. I actually pick these up quite often. My daughter loves them, but I love that this time they had the yellow inside the ear. Usually they do pink or blue. Her favorite color is yellow. She does like to wear that. And sometimes we just like to dress up. So I thought this was really cute. And I really love that they actually had the little pom-pom tail as well. And there's a little clip so you can clip it to your pants or your shirt or whatever is closest to where you want to put it. So I just thought that was super adorable. That's everything for my Dollar Tree haul this time. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, I would love a thumbs up. I'd also love any comments you'd like to leave me down below. If you're not already subscribed, I'd love to have you and I hope to see you again soon. Talk to you later. Bye.